I'm gonna blow your mind. Everybody, hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Attack of the B Team. And we got a lot going on today. Honestly, I don't know what to do first. I'm just busy beaver over here with all this molten glass. Whoa, look at all that stuff. Holy molten metals. But we're uh, preparing for this winter log cabin experience thing. I think I need a hammer. So let's get one that's almost out. That, that hammer's going to be dead. It won't even make it to the icy hills. Hello? Oh, that, that took a while. I got it? Good. Okay. We'll need our spatula, also known as chisel. That went right there. I have been making this glass for what seems like days. You'll see what I mean when we get over to those icy hills. We have so many things over there now. Not even funny. I mean, it's just taking me forever to get the supplies. We're going to need this silk touch shovel because when you hit snow with your hand, it disappears. We're going to we got a lot of snow to move around over there, and I think I might have bitten off a little more than I could chew. Yeah, honestly. I mean, this cabin with how wide and long it is, I'm just I'm hoping it doesn't turn into a mega build. Let's make sure nothing bad is in here. Mm, I think we're clear. Very good. Let's go over and say hi to Sunny Boy. Look at him, Mr. Mischievous over here. <laughs> Look at I don't know how these rose reds happen. I guess these roosters, roasters, whatever the things be called. Maybe not only do they give us these flowers, but maybe they also give us rose reds too. And eggs. I am very thankful for everything they give us. But the little sunny boy here wants to go to the icy hills. Mm -mm, you can't go. You're a bad dude. Baby Theory, I know you want to go. You can't. You can't. You wrecked the place. Man, as, I'm built, as quick as I can build it, I know that kid will wreck it. So let's see what the mad scientist has come up with. Winter Lodge and go. So we've been, uh, well, we haven't started anything yet. I've been saving it for the episode. But preparation for this episode has been pretty crazy. You see the little square up there? We're going to fly over to it. This whole area, the whole top part has to go. Reason why? When we start building, I believe it is so tall, I hope it's not that tall. Honestly, I don't want to build a mega build because we're in survival. I know I'm flying around. Thank goodness we could fly around because of the advanced genetics. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't do something this big. But I'm really hoping it's kind of small. I don't know what I'm going to get into. And I started this kind of in creative. I have a creative test world that'll give me an idea. The honest truth is I only start at the front, but man, do we have a lot of work to do. And we're not going to do it all on camera. This is going to be a, a cutaway kind of awesome thing we do. And if you guys want to build along with me, good luck. Because <laughs> it's taken a while, man, just to get to this point. This is 38 blocks wide and 32 blocks long and don't worry don't sweat it these two pretty little trees here you won't miss them I know they're awesome looking and you know all that but there's gonna be an awesome log cabin up there someday hopefully soon <laughs> and in preparation of all this you can see we got some lot of wood lot of stone I, I hope I have it all I don't know if we will and we got a bed because there will be many sleepless nights here in the icy hills. Just trying to get this darn thing up. So the silk touch, why is that important? Here's why. 
I'm going to have to fill in all these gaps. Please work. Good. If you hit snow with your hand, I don't believe you get it back. See, we're collecting all these blocks. We're going to have to build it back up and put it back in. Kind of like this. Here, let me show you. Snow, where are you at? 47 quick pieces. And hopefully it stays. But we're going to build this in like this. And we kind of need to make like a square. Now this stuff is mostly going to be the things I will be doing off camera. But this all has to get knocked down. We will build in the corners and have fun doing it. Underneath, I have to build it out and do something to make it look cool. And let's all say a prayer that this darn cabin isn't bigger than what I have laid out here. Because holy smokes, we'll be at this for 20 million Minecraft hours. If you guys that watch have a series, you know what I'm talking about. So we're going to be doing some of that stuff. And uh, we'll be right back. Okay, guys, the one thing that I am afraid of, glass, of running out of, is this clear glass that you have to tink, tink up. Man, it's taking so long to tinker this glass, too. Did I get it all? No. Why does some come out and some not come out? I'll never understand that. Because <clears throat> we're going to need a lot of this stuff, and we don't want to run out. But we're about ready to start this project. It took me forever and a day and a half and another 15 minutes on top of that just to do what I just did. So holy smokes. And we have enough snow now. Now we won't have any snow worries. Winter Lodge, bang. Okay. Now as you will see, it's flat. It is cleared out, and I think I have an idea of what we're about to do. Now, most of our stuff is here, and we're going to need a lot of stone. Look at all this snow we got. We're, we're going to need all this, too. I don't know if we're going to need the glass right away. But let's just get this stuff in here. Okay, so we took all that out. Got glass. Should be good. Get out the spatula. Because we're going to chisel. And I do have a pitcher in mind. Like, I have a pitcher. I didn't design this out of my awesome brain. If I was that awesome, I wouldn't be selling cars for a living. I'd be designing these houses. But I think what I want to do, I think it's going to go right here. Here, let's put a block. Okay, they could be carpenter blocks. Why not? Why not? It's going to be something like this. Now I'm just wasting stuff. Okay. This, one, two, one, two. This is where the windows are going to go. In a log cabin, log cabins have lots of windows. Lots of windows. Let's just take a take a peek. Going to be lots of windows in this place. And the front part of the log cabin is the biggest. So we got one, two in a row, two in a row, one. And then we'll have two in a row, two in a row, one. So this is what I think should be okay. And please, God, let it be long enough. Let, let it be smaller than this square. And that's not going to be exactly in the middle because of the style that I'm going for. But hopefully it works out. Let's get a lot of glass out. I think I want to go three high with this glass. The glass goes on the ones with the two. Yeah, just like that. Okay. And we're starting. We got a build going on. I am slightly scared. With the size 
Oh, the size of this thing just really does scare me. And do I have enough material? I'll, I'll never know. And then we're going to go on top like this. Whew. Look at that. Uh, this is going to be... This is going to be a project. This is going to be a project. Where did my windows go? 24 windows, clear glass, just like that, and gone. So we will need a lot of glass. So here's what just happened to me yesterday. Is <clears throat> I never wash my car, ever. And the only time it gets washed is when I get service done. Like if I need an oil change to the place where I work, we'll wash it for free. So I normally get very excited about that. Hate paying for an oil change, but I love... Is it, wow, that is big. But I love getting... Uh, love getting my car washed. So I finally get my car washed. What am I going to do here? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. And then we'll do that. Yeah. So I get my car washed, and of course, let's take a sleep and tell you about my crazy car wash story. Um, get my car washed, all excited about it, and on my way home at night. I mean, birds aren't even supposed to be out at night. They're like daytime critters, I would think. It's all about the daytime for those guys. And I'm going to do another row on the top. So I stop at a red light. Light turns red. I stop like, you know, good drivers do. And the biggest, the biggest bird crap that has ever crapped on my car happened. I would love to see the size of this bird. I mean, absolutely enormous. It was like human size. Did not mean to put that there. And splattered all over the hood of my car. Um, just completely upset about this. Because I was so excited that I got my darn car washed. And now it's still on there. Like if I walk out in the driveway right now. It looks like somebody just took a big old thing of concrete. Is what it looks like. A big bag of mixed concrete with rocks in it. And slammed it on the hood of my car. Now I know we're in the mod pack. And mostly everything that we do here. Is going to be true to the mod. The mod pack. Because you know this isn't vanilla. Let's do something really cool crazy and fun. There is going to be a layer here. On top of this. Man I hope I'm doing this the right way. This is a lot of blocks to be taken off. There's a bottom part, and then there's a top part. And this glass will... Ugh. I mean, it pains me just to think about it, but that glass will go up. Hopefully not into the clouds. But let me, let me double-check something here with a little chisel magic. Get out the spatula. Yeah, so now we got the biggest crap I've ever seen on my car. I don't understand it. I absolutely don't don't understand birds at all. Now I'm gonna microblock that. Okay. So let's get some of this as well. I think we're gonna go with these. And it should turn out pretty cool. I did bring my saw, right? Oh, I love that. And let's saw some of these up. We're going to need tons. Yes, we will. 20, almost as, nope, this one, yes. Okay, that'll stay in. Good. Okay. So there's going to be a deck. 
And remember last episode, we said that we're going to stand on this deck and we're going to have the most beautiful view in the world. Well, we are. It's going to be the most awesome view in the world. And I think, I think this is going to be right about there, like this. Now I, <laughs> that's why I leave my axe out. Is it a pickaxe? Yes. Okay. These micro blocks, such a pain in the tuchus. There we go. Oh yeah, fun for everyone. Ah ha 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 ah, ha. Block going the wrong way. So this is going to be a deck, and it's going to be two different colors. This middle part is going to be, I want to say, one, two, one, two, three. It's going to be like three, then we're going to put a dark one. And then this is going to be four three it's gonna be something like this oh darn it that's gonna be the story of this episode everybody laugh jeez okay is that good okay and and these dark ones are gonna go on the outside so the honest truth is I have an idea for the design but I don't want to do it all on camera because this is gonna take forever and basically the deck is going to go like this and it's going to go all along here and it's going to look pretty so let's do that I think that's how it is is that how it is yes let's do this deck here and I will be right back I promise I got a feeling that the top part of this cabin is going to be crazy. It's going to be very crazy. If I could give the best advice in the world, I think it would be this. When you're building, mess it up so bad that you learn from your mistakes, and that way it's a lot easier to build it the second time. <laughs> I feel like I've just been, you know, making making my life a nightmare I mean this trying to figure out this roof design has been craziness so where these just like on the bottom here we're gonna look see wherever there's two blocks like here there is going to be some clear glass and we will do them three high just like on the bottom so far so good this is not the crazy part the crazy part comes after we do this level and dog bark do you guys have crazy dogs I mean they're always barking well out of all the dogs you could get why do I have to have the barkers I guess it's happy though. It's not a mad bark or anything like that. I have two dogs that just love to play all day. And if they're around while I'm playing, doesn't matter whether record is on or not. Let's see how she looks. They bring toys and put them in my lap. And that's great. They're happy dogs. <clears throat> very, very happy. Just so you know, this is where the chaos starts. Now we have to build this place up on an angle. And I think these are full windows, if I'm not mistaken. But we're going up four this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So four high. Am I out of glass? Oh my gosh. If I don't have enough glass for this project, which I might not... I'll be mad and cry. Now this is the tricky part. I think... I think we have to start doing some of this stuff. Yeah. See that? It has to go up, like, step by step. 
So here, 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 because it's going up on an angle. And that. This goes across. This is going to be the craziest roof design in the whole Minecraft world. Okay. That looks nuts. Oh my gosh, where are the clouds at? We're almost at cloud level. And we we still have another... We still have some more to go. Okay. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, one. And then you build this up. It, it's... I hope I'm not out. I hope I still have some more. So the si look at how humongous that thing is going to be. Do we have more glass? Please say yes. Oh, we got 64 left. Perfect. We will have enough for this <laughs> for this episode. So how is this going to go? This is going to do the same thing, I guess. 3 4 just like that, just like this. Okay, I know I said just like that, just like this a lot. But that's because I'm trying to figure stuff out. This is going to be one of the craziest things I've ever done in Minecraft. It's like, let, and we'll check the view out while we're up here too. Wow. Holy top of the world. Where are the clouds at? A cloud come by, chop my face off. Can I reach it? There we go. Look at this thing. Jeez. Wow, that is the front glass area. Oh my gosh, it's going to be huge. I don't want to go in the portal yet. Where do you see these blocks? It's these carpenter wedges. This is going to be the part that's going to be hard to figure out. So this is going to be like this. Because we're playing Attack of the B Team, you got to know we can't do a blocky roof. We could do a very awesome... There's the clouds! I knew we were up that high. I knew it. Look at that! We are one block from the clouds. How lucky did we get? Can't see. Get out of my eye. This is going to be... Huh. Thank goodness I'm not afraid of heights. This is going to be a crazy roof design. Now we have to build it out. What did I do? Okay. I'm going to show you how this goes down. This is probably going to come out three blocks. And I know that part doesn't match. That's okay. With a hammer, we could do something special. This is going to come out further. Let me chop this out of here to give you guys an idea of what we're after. Okay. And we need... Can I do one like this? Oh, yeah, yeah. That'll be good. And what goes in the middle then? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe a carpenter block? I don't know. Where my hammer at? Now, when you hammer these, you right-click, and it'll do all kinds of funky stuff. Whenever it's one block, you want to use one of these. I kind of like the way that looks. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to complete this down, and what we're going to do, before we break away, let me show you what it's going to look like. I think we should go with something dark, and I think we should do something like a log. Dark log at your service. And it's going to look like this. You have to look down when you do this. Like that. And it looks like a shingle. It, it does look like a shingle. 
So we're going to shingle this baby up, make it look crazy good, and we will be right back after I add a ton of these. We're, we're going to be adding a lot more. So let's see what it looks like. Okay, guys, I think I got a design picked out that's working pretty good for us. You know, the magic is isn't when you're putting it on top. It's actually when you go underneath and you make it look like this. This is where it all kind of comes together. And I'm not quite sure whether this side matches the other side. If it doesn't, we could always fix it. That's the beautiful thing. We just fix it when, when we need to. I think it's identical. But when you're on top, you must look straight down in order for it to do this. Otherwise, you're looking at the top of the log, and it won't look like a shingle. Now, when you're doing it from underneath, you must look like this. Did I do that the right way? I think so. I think that's okay. Is that the same as the other side? I think it is. Well, that's the way it goes. So we picked out a design. I think it's going to stay like this. It has been a long episode. <laughs> a lot of thinking with these builds. So if you have enjoyed this build as much as I have, slap a like on it. And let me know in the comments if you want me to do a lot more building on this on camera. If you do, we'll do a lot more on camera. If not, we'll just keep cutting away like we do. But we are off to a very good start here in the icy hills. And no creepers blew us up yet. And Junior isn't running around, ripping it apart. So the next time you see this, we're going to... Well, we're going to do a little bit off camera, but let me know how much do you want me to do on camera. If you like the way I roll, give me a shout. Peace. I'm out. I'm going to blow your mind.